Hello my dear students I am myself Dr Rajesh Gubba I am the general medicine educator In today's short video I'll be discussing about the pre excitation syndromes So we have two important pre excitation syndromes that is Wolff Parkinson White syndrome and Lown Ginnon Levine syndrome So in this session I'll discuss about the Wolff Parkinson White syndrome So Wolff Parkinson White syndrome it is a pre excitation syndrome because it has the presence of an accessory pathway which will connect the atria to the ventricles and because of this what will be the ecg changes very very important ecg finding will be the short pr interval and if you take the qrs complex you have the wide qrs complex and the presence of the delta wave where you have sl slurring of the r wave and if you take the t wave the t wave will be inverted so these are the ecg changes in wpw syndrome one of the very important multiple choice question on wpw syndrome is most common cardiac anomaly associated with wpw syndrome the options are tetralogy of fallo epstein's anomaly vsd and coarctation of aorta so the answer is the epstein's anomaly and what is this epstein's anomaly epstein's anomaly is distal displacement of the tricuspid valve thereby there will be 